Crowds formed outside the union as Southern Smash kicked off their college tour here at Ole Miss. I struggled with an eating disorder for 15 years, and I've been in recovery two years now. Um, I struggled when I was a student here at Ole Miss, um, but there wasn't a lot of support out there, or at least I didn't reach out for it. And so I developed Southern Smash last year as a way to provide support, let people know that they're not alone, and raise awareness for eating disorders, as well as promote positive body image amongst all uh, young women. Ole Miss is known for being in the top of hottest student body rankings of universities. This creates unspoken competition for physical perfection. But are eating disorders ever brought to the surface here? I don't think they're talked about because I think it's such a hush topic and it makes people uncomfortable. Um, and so that's what we're about. We're about making people uncomfortable and doing something as physical and odd as smashing scales to get the conversation started because that's what it needs to happen. If one person starts to talk about it, then the conversation can start to change. The event includes bandana decorating, let it go balloons, where girls write their perfect number on paper, tie it to a balloon, and let it go. And scale smashing. So just what is the scale smashing? Well, it's quite literally taking a sledgehammer to the scale and smashing it to prove that you're not the number that it shows. Let it go. <laughs> Liberating, definitely. It felt good. You are surrounded by this stereotypical beauty, and it is. I mean, the people here are beautiful, but are they really seeing the real beauty within themselves? Hearing everything she's been through has made it an incredible journey, and I would love for everybody to feel as beautiful as she does now. The goal is to free students from the idea of perfection to find their natural beauty. Southern Smash has received national recognition and partners with the National Eating Disorder Association. The program will travel to universities nationwide this fall.